Hey guys, headed to the gym, taking my breakfast. This is my breakfast actually. I use spirulina. This is actually my breakfast. It's also a muscle builder. It's also a meal replacement and it helps detox. Now, sometimes this shit make me go to the bathroom, literally, <laughs> right away. So, happy Tuesday. Headed to the gym, right? Headed to the gym, guys, right? So, what does fourth quarter living mean? Right? What, what, what does fourth quarter living mean to you guys? What does it mean, right? See, all the businesses that are successful, they're planning. Well, they started planning in August for now, okay? They started planning in September for now. Okay, a lot of department stores, they're getting ready for Christmas and Halloween and Thanksgiving. A lot of small businesses are also getting ready for Christmas and Halloween and Thanksgiving. Even online sales, guys, is getting ready for Halloween, Christmas, uh, you know, and Thanksgiving, you know. So at the end of the day, guys, right, we can learn, right, as small business owners, right, we can learn from these big giants, um, you know, that are preparing, right? They prepare ahead. They literally prepare a season ahead, right? So they can maximize profits. Now, why is this the fourth quarter so significant, guys? Because the fourth quarter, right, is all the holidays crunched up in one, right? And what does holiday time mean, right? What does holiday time mean to you guys, right? To me, holiday time means being with my family, you know, eating with them, cooking with them, sharing thoughts, sharing gifts, sharing, uh, you know, ideas, uh, you know, just loving each other, right? That's what, you know, holiday time, uh, you know, means to me, right? So majority of people, that's what holiday time means, right? But it also means spending money. It also means spending money, okay? People literally feel like they have done nothing all year for themselves and their family members or co-workers or supervisors or all that. Or some people just want to suck up to their supervisors or co-workers and they start to go into a buying frenzy. Okay, this is the consumer side, right? The business side, you, you literally stock up on products okay you stock up on merchandise now you can't stock up on services but products you can stock up on merchandise you stock up on right so the consumer says oh well it's holiday time let me spend people literally guys spend at least 10 grand in the fourth quarter and online right you can do your own research and, and see what is the average amount of money that the average person spends during the fourth quarter the average person got to spend between five and fifteen thousand dollars. This is just on shopping for loved ones and co-workers and shit. It's crazy, right? That's fucking insane, right? But as the business owner, you know that. Okay, not saying everybody, because everybody don't have 10 grand to spend, but they're saying the average person who's making about a hundred thousand uh, you know, a year. Uh, you know, have a job, you know, have a decent paying job. They spend about five to 10 grand right now in the fourth quarter. So as the business owner, you know that you need to be getting that money. So the other day I sold something on Amazon and one of the ladies, uh, I guess she was the customer. I don't know who she was really, cause she didn't buy it. She was just saying that, oh, you guys are price gouging. You know, we're trying to buy stuff for our families in Puerto Rico and you guys are price gouging. And I said, listen, at the end of the day, Amazon doesn't put no price restriction. If I want to sell something for $200 or if I want to sell something for $20, I can. Right? So it's a free market, guys, on Amazon. Amazon is a free market. And I want to stress this, guys. I am focused on e-commerce this fourth quarter and cryptocurrency. That's it. Yeah, I got my affiliates running. Yeah, I got my affiliate programs running. I'm running ads for those. But I'm not focused on it, guys. Because guess what? Guess what? Last year, December, just in December, guys, alone, just in December, guys, alone, I made 20 grand just in December from Amazon. Okay? <laughs> it's a secret, right? So I know more now, right? See, last year, I just started, right? I started Amazon in October. 
Okay, so I just basically started Amazon, right? But I still made money, right? But now I have more knowledge. Now I have more experience. Oh, I think I can make 30 grand, right? 30 grand in the month of December, but I literally can make 30 grand from now to December, right? So here's the thing, guys. <clears throat> I tell people this all the time, right? Make sure you download my ebook because my ebook, I go into all of this stuff and how you need to get started and how you need to be that force to get started in your life. You need to be the force to create your own business. You need to be the force to create your own income. You need to be the force to show your children. I was in tears the other day. One of my business partners, you know, we do cryptocurrency and, you know, we have a platform that we use where we get interest every day on our money. So he got his five-year-old investing, five, young black man, okay? See, this is not taught to us, guys, right? So you break the tree, you break the poverty line, you break the, 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 the impoverished mindset by you starting. You start to do something different so that your children can have something different. My business partner, he started cryptocurrency last year. Now his son is five years old. He got his son investing at five years old. I was in tears because I was like, yes, you're breaking the poverty cycle, okay? You're breaking the impoverished mindset. You're breaking the broke cycle. I'm telling you guys, I get emotional about this guys because rich people and wealthy people do it every day. They empower their children to invest. They empower their children to grow their money. They empower their children to start a business or take over their business. Meanwhile, people that are poor, people that are broke, all they do is teach their kids to be poor and broke. I'm telling you guys, my mom used to always say, I don't have money. 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 That's all my mom used to say. I was like, well, damn, when do we ever have money then? As I grew up, guys, I realized that money is in abundance. It only flows to the ones who know how to keep it, invest it, treat it, okay, and save it. Everybody can get money, but most people can't keep it. Everybody can get money, but most people know how to invest it, right? So at five years old, guys, his son is investing. Do you know what that does to his mindset? He not worried about, oh, I'm gonna go get a job. He invests $500 and let that compound for a year, another year, another two years, guys, by the time he 18, he could have four or five million dollars. Literally, four, five million dollars, 10 million dollars by the time he's 18. He's five now. That's the shit I'm talking about, guys. This is what I'm talking about, breaking the cycle, right? That's why I'm so passionate about this stuff, guys. I'm passionate about this, right? passionate about it okay breaking the cycle guys right and amazon can help you break the cycle and amazon's coming out with their own coin their own cryptocurrency but how many people gonna get in on that i am i'm gonna get in on that are you gonna get in on that right amazon they might start you know selling at one dollar shit i'm trying to get as many coins from amazon as possible because i believe amazon coin can be as much as bitcoin right now which is about four thousand now it's going to take time for it to get there but guess what it's going to get there okay guys so let's break the cycle stop making excuses your kid's going to be broke if you're broke that's it i grew up broke guys why because my mom was broke my dad was broke i guarantee my kids ain't growing up broke my kid, I got my kids making investments at 8 and 15, breaking the cycle. I'm even helping my grandmother make investments. Break the cycle, guys. It starts with you, not your kids, not your spouse. Guys, this shit start with you. That's what I talk about in my book. Make sure you download my ebook. You be the force. You be the force to start. Don't tell your kid to go get a job. You got a job, don't you? And you tired of that job. You sick of that fucking job. You hate that fucking job. You hate them fucking pennies you working for. So why the fuck would you tell your kids that same bullshit? I'm telling you guys. I'm telling you, right? You know, I'm just passionate about this, guys. I get emotional. 
about this, guys, because especially black people, man. You know, we, we're the most impoverished, but we spend the most fucking money. Right? We spent nine billion on weave last year. Nine billion on fucking weave? I contributed about two grand to that. <clears throat> or more. Okay? We gotta get our priorities, guys. Rich people focus on the next generation. And the next generation. Black people, right? Most only focus on themselves. Oh no, well, I gotta go to work. I gotta go to work. I gotta go to work. I gotta pay my rent. I gotta pay my car. No. Oh, I gotta go get my nails done. So what about your great grandkids? See, nobody thinks about that shit. Nobody thinks about their great grandkids. Right? Most black people don't think about their great grandkids. They don't give a fuck about their great grandkids. Oh well, huh, they'll find a job. No, guys, we gotta give a fuck. This is why white people, not all. But people that are wealthy, guys, they stick together, okay? They stick together. They plan for the next generation, the next two generations, while most black people only plan for a trip to go to the Bahamas or a cruise and to go clubbing. Ain't that some shit, right? Most wealthy people plan for three generations, while most black people plan for the club or a cruise, the crews don't bring you no money. The club don't bring you no money. I'm telling you guys, being in business has transformed my mindset. That's why I can't get a job. I can never get a job. I never ever want to get a job. I never want to be a part of a job setting anymore because it cannot help me grow, guys. Life is about growing. A job cannot help my money grow. Money, the whole point of money, guys, is to grow it. A job can't help me do those two things. A job cannot help me be prosperous. It can't, guys. It can't help me be prosperous at all. It can't help me elevate. It's like fucking crabs at a job. I hated my fucking job. I'm telling you, I hated that shit. My first two years, I thought I was the shit. Oh, I got a degree. Oh, I'm making 30 grand a year. Ooh, 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 ooh. I'm good. Ooh, 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 ooh. I'm marvelous, yes. I was broke as a joke. Okay, I'm thank and I thank my cousin all the time for introducing me to the network marketing industry. And I just ran with it. And that's it, guys. So let me introduce you to e-commerce. Let me introduce you to cryptocurrency so you can say, you know what? I thank Tanisha Marie for introducing me to this new world that can help me change my life, that can help me change my family tree, that can help me transform my motherfucking life. That's what it's about, guys. So fourth quarter living. All the businesses, they make more money in the fourth quarter than the whole fucking year, believe it or not. Okay? If you're an entrepreneur, guess what? It's time to make most money this year, guys. And what I love about e-commerce, guys, I can list unlimited amount of products. I can make unlimited amount of sales. See, the problem with network marketing during the fourth quarter is that now you gotta work harder. I don't wanna work harder. No. Network marketing, you gotta be running around, doing one-on-ones, trying to do home meetings, trying to do hotel meetings, trying to do three-way calls, trying to sell products. I don't got to worry about that shit, guys, with e-commerce, whether you're doing Shopify or Amazon, you can list millions of items. You can make unlimited amount of sales, and you ain't got to be chasing a motherfucker. I'm telling you guys, fourth quarter living. Fourth quarter living, right? So maybe maybe, maybe you, you don't grasp this now. Maybe you'll grasp it next year, fourth quarter living. But get started. Get started today, guys today so you can have something when you go home to look forward to so you can work your business people work their whole life and don't have shit people work their whole life and don't have shit it would be a sad day guys if you retire and you've been listening to me and you've been following me and you don't have shit you just wasting time. You just wasting time. Love you guys. Subscribe. <laughs>
share my video with your cousin aunt text them this video so they can watch it and watch my Amazon webinar get started right Amazon webinar right my basic is 400 my intermediate is 500 and my mastermind is two grand if you're serious you'll go to the two grand if you just want to put your toe in you'll be at the basic simple as that it's plain and simple okay guys create my own economy.com see that's my website right I created that website because I want to empower people to create their own economy you don't have to depend on Trump. You ain't got to depend on the president. You ain't got to depend on your job. The job is not the only way to make money. I'm serious. Hopefully I'll wake some people up, guys. See you soon.